What's happening beautiful gamers? Blank here and welcome back to another episode of The Last Faith. And well, we're starting this exactly where we left off because we don't really have the time to go back and try to defeat all of those enemies again. So instead, we're just going to be proceeding proceeding through the Juno's ministry and try to figure out what is it that this place is going to have or is going to be hiding from us. Now, um I do want to point out that it feels like this is obviously the, the end of the game per se. So we are almost there at the end mark. I wonder how much more the oh wow, this thing's alive. That water is kind of like annoying. But yeah, I mean, it's kind of cool to see that this is almost the end of the game and it is as messed up as you would have anticipated. Friendly reminder though, if you guys are enjoying these episodes, you can always let me know by doing the most beautiful thing that you can, which is leaving a like, and of course, if you have not done so yet, don't forget to subscribe. Subscribing to the channel is always heavily appreciated. Priests note, it is not atop this holy place where flesh and the divine can connect, the chaos of the past surrounding these walls, yet the place where the celestial meets the earth must be learned, a sepulchre, a beacon. Whoever discovers such a place must ascend, both in mind and body, or body and mind. Uh, is there something at the bottom? Secret? Come on, come on! Don't do that to me, game. If you, if you, if you give me such a big wall at the very least, like you know, give me, give me some love. And this, this looks like it can be the excellent. Wait, which is the right path? Dang it! Oh no, this is gonna be gauntlet, of course. Okay, I'm gonna have to use some of the healing items that I have. I do not have anything else. Okay, that's a lot of damage. Okay, at the very least, we can actually kill them. Then utilize another one of our healings and then kill this one. This should be the... Oh, that's it. Okay, some healing items. Yes, thank you. Thank you so much for that. And then what are we getting here? Ooh, and what is this? Let me guess. For the witch? Not with the witch, but the, the other one? Never mind. Federal Admiral's Cannon. An infamous relic of the technology age. This cannon has devastating power, yet it is very expensive to maintain due to the high cost of ammunition. It is now the preserve of only the most powerful members of the Eternal Order. Its purpose, its purpose dedicated to science. An emergency measure should an experiment get out of hand. Um, okay. It uses six bullets, but it looks sick, so I might use it. No other secrets. Pretty cool looking weapon though, so... With all the money that I have, I might take this opportunity to increase my focus. Maybe put it in a place where I'm not gonna have negative on my weapons. And then after that, you know, just actually invest the powers correctly and... Um, and then um, level up the weapon. I mean, I think we can do all of that. I mean, not with the money that I have, but I mean, enemies are giving me so much experience or so much sneak rooks that might not be too difficult to like farm them for a little bit just to be able to max out the weapons nice yeah i need you to die but right now you're kind of like yeah exactly i need you to die but right now you are being a little bit annoying and i have to remove the bleeding because that's annoying can i remove the bleeding no no wait what add negative effects is there anything for bleeding I have to actually use this one. Yeah, stay away from that blood. You don't really want to touch it too long. Items at the top. That's fine. Oh, secret wall. I love it. And then this place probably goes to the top. So let's go through the secret. Hello there. What is this? Witch thing? Witch? Yes? Ah, the last healing bolster. Well, it says that that's the last one. We got the achievement. Eternal Order Node. The last node! A once magnificent fortress is now a mere refugee for one who manipulates the celestial power unfathomed by mortals. All is protected from unwanted eyes. 
there is only one way into such a bastion, a mirror, yet this location has been lost. It, that, that tip right there seems like that whole situation with the witch, like the, the, the ghost that you can actually get going because of the mirror palace or something like that. Wow, dick. Yo, you, that was out of control. Listen, that's a, that was a little bit too much. So, it's not appreciated what you just did. I'm just letting you know. No secrets. Mm. Let me guess. No secrets either? Of course not. Okay, so two places. Maybe this is gonna have a safe spot. Yes, you see? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Let's walk all the way to the right just in case there's something here that might have missed. Seems like we are gonna be able to go back in here. That's fine. And if we take a look at the map, this is climbing up, so it's probably gonna connect there. Well, I did level up my I mean I did level up my character and um I did max out my weapon, so now we can do pretty chunky damage with that. Uh, I also took the opportunity to give to the lady with the baby thingy. The other one we're missing too. Hopefully we will be able to find those two that we're missing in here. Otherwise I'm gonna have to figure that out on my own and that's gonna be insane if I have to do that. How much damage do you do? That's a lot of damage. 700? That's pretty sexy. That's pretty good. It's actually pretty, pretty, pretty good. So I'll take I'll take that experience and what the freak? Die. Okay, so this map connects. It doesn't, but we can go all the way to the right so we can... Okay. Which way do I want to go? Let's go left first. Seems like to the left we're going to be able to find a shortcut. And I do like me shortcuts. Why is that so high? Were you like trying to prevent the... The enemies from being able to do something? Oh, I didn't level up. I do, I'm not leveling up my strength any further. Because we have reached out a point where... Leveling up my strength only increases my damage by like 3. So... Yeah, it's not something that we really are too interested on in doing. Are you gonna attack me again or are you just gonna wait there and be a punching bag? I guess he just waited to be a punching bag. If that's your dream though, I mean, respects, you did a fantastic job. The fact that we have 15 healing items also helps out a lot. And that's the door. Yep. And that beautiful door takes you all the way out. So now we have another save, but there's no real point to it. There is really no real point to it. It's like, what, 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 why? Why is that even a thing? Sometimes this game, I swear. Cannot make it there. I gotta figure out how to get there. That's probably going all the way from the left. Uh, yeah, that thing is gonna be annoying, but can I kill this thing? Uh, I mean, he's there. At the very least, this one died. No, 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 die, die, die. Don't, don't, don't summon, don't summon. Yes, it's summon it. No, are those there? You guys think that we put in here the call levers or something? Huh. Is that like a I mean that looks like a furnace. Yeah, that's fine, but it's so strange. It feels as if there was something that you would be able to put in there. Especially if we take a look at the map. Yeah, see that? It feels like you can progress through it, but how? Oh, I see. So I guess this is for the family crest. You guys remember? Uh, I think I think we're missing one family crest. I think if you put it in there, you would be able to like trigger that, and then by triggering that, it opens up. And I think so, maybe. Because it looks like it, it has the same shapes shapes as the family crest. So. Give me this little shortcut over here. I'll take it. And then we can get this. No secrets? 
No more secrets. Mm. You know, I'm really worried right now because I do want to get the things from the lady, but I haven't been able to get whatever it is that she wants. I'm still missing two. And I do not know where... Like, I've been super through on the game. Like, no jokes. I've been super duper through, so... Okay, this is another shortcut. And what are we getting here? You guys have no idea how hard am I, like, begging the game to give me the items that I'm looking for. Can this go higher? Yes, we can. Right, and then from grabbing this, what do we get? There are some places where we can enter. What is the point of entering? Not sure. What is the point of doing this? Not sure either. Starving essences, kind of useless. But at the very least, we defeat enemies that give you a kind of like a little bit good necrux. Okay, let's explore the way to the left. It's a healing injection, nothing too good. But the game is trying. Do it. That was a little bit aggressive, but I'll take it. And then this one is the last section, which is nothing, and then... Wait. Yeah, there was absolutely nothing. It's just to unveil the map. And then this one is locked in here. Okay, so we're just gonna have to go through those doors, I guess. And this is the outside. Don't try to bleed me, you creature. Yeah, just die, please. Thank you. Any enemy that is trying to bleed you, they are not that cool. Oh, so it's not the family crescent. It's just that we need to kill those monks. Can we go through the top? Not really. And if we take a look at the map, it seems like there's nothing that we can do. I mean, it seems like we can die, because you see the, the fog, but I do not know. Anyway, it's time to go for the second one. Only see only 460 damage. That's one of my problems. It's like, I mean, of course, if you were to focus on focus or uh, instincts, you would be able to like level up that, and your weapons would be doing so much damage. Of course, one of the problems with the weapons doing that much damage is that you actually have to farm the. Um, you actually have to farm the. The bullets. And that's a big event. I mean, you can buy them. So what you really need to farm is the Nikrux. You guys get it. Cannot really go up. Okay, one more. Nice. Healing injection. I appreciate you worrying about how much... Or how many healing items I can actually use. Damn, I thought I was gonna fall. You know, I truly hope this is not the end of the game. I mean, if it is, it is what it is, but... But my hopes is that we still got the opportunity to explore a little bit more. Uh, yo, 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 these guys are out of control. Those guys are out of control. Yeah, you, you want to see? This is the true power. And then I can do this. Give me the healing potions. Kill this guy because he's on the way. And now, these little two fellas. That's. Oh, hello, what's that? Okay. It's not that it's high. It is high. But the game was trying to send me flying. Rude. By putting that other guy in there, the game was like, yeah, how about you go flying and you kind of like die? 
I was like, what? Excuse you? Anyways, that pretty much cleanses the map, yes? I think so. I, I don't think there's anything else. All of them are like mirrors of each other. It's all the same. The big cathedral, so we're fine. And then from here, all there is left to do is go straight. There should be that shortcut after crossing this area. Yes, there is. And from here, yeah, we have the save. Let's go. Now, even if we finish the game, I will still do whatever I need to do to get the item so we can face uh, that boss. And then after facing that boss, of course, I can show this episode. You guys will know once it's posted. Ah, uh, what is this? Secret, please? No! I didn't actually do that, but I guess the joystick was too sensible, so... Ah, please! Please, game, please! Don't make me... Don't do this to me. What is that sound? Oh, wait, why? what was that? That's not fair. Okay, at the very least, I can kill one of them. Now he goes down. Beautiful. First boss of the game becomes a regular enemy. And as a regular enemy, he is just like he was when we beat him the first time. A little bitch. Please be a secret drawer. No secret doors anymore. I need you to be a secret door now, please. I'm begging the game right now. Like at this point, I have no shame. I'm begging the game to please make it that I didn't miss it. Because otherwise, the backtracking that I might need to do is going to be insane. Yo, that's doing too much damage. That might kill me. Oh, that was so close. Do another one. Stay healthy. And then 73,000. See what I mean? It's like you get you you can get those. Like you can you get the Nick Rook so fast that you don't even have to worry about it. Ah, boss fight. Oh, you again. What's up, lady? My attempt to face the treacherous Ladak was in vain. It was my only opportunity to correct what has been done. What you and I have both done has doomed the world to more than it can endure. Tis a load that was always too leaden for our shoulders. In order to vanquish Ladak, we must find a solution. And I fear it will not be a painless one. Oh, you're not gonna fight me? Are, you, are we friends now? My attempt to face in order So she's telling you if you go straight you're gonna face Ladak. Okay, give me the boss fight. Your fortunes are at an end, Nightorn. My power is too great to contend. A power you cannot truly fathom. My reign is sealed by my new kin, by the sepulchre. All shall kneel to me, honor me. I am the architect of your existence, Nycton. All that you have is a gift of my benevolence. But now, for your insolence, I shall take it. Oh, back! Super try hard, bro. Yeah, super try hard. Kneel for your faith is sealed. Kneel for your faith is sealed. How about your faith, bro? Your faith is super sealed. Yeah. 
This is a two-faced boss fight. There's no way that he's gonna try to do something else. Yo, hey, what was that, like, super... What was that super insane, crazy... A Lord Seath. Seath. You know, he actually looks like Palpatine. He does look like Palpatine. Okay, dodge that. Nope. So now, what are you gonna do, bro? Do it. Bye, Balpatine. Bye. Boom. Oh, one more. <laughs> ah, let's go. Bear witness, Night Dawn. Your time has come. All shall obey me. Surrender to the ultimate power. For I am the true God, the final savior, the last thing! Well... That double jump helps him out a lot. I can use this to my advantage. Yeah, the iframes on that are super insane, so... Yeah, the iframes are helping out a lot. Ah, 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 ah. No, no, no. No, no, no. Nope. Nope. Stay away. No! Don't cheat on me like that, bro. Oh, so that's what you're trying to do, Le Lord Patrick Ladak. Listen, you gave up your humanity. For what? Oh wait, that's that's pretty cool actually. Yeah, this guy gave up his humanity just for the sake of trying to kill me. Bro, you're giving me too much credit. Just say it. Oh wait, that was cool. Uh, you're gonna do the sappy sappy one more. Oh no, not enemies. Well, I need to kill one of them at the very least so I don't have to deal with both at the same time. Now, can you please come here and face me, you my friend? Oh no, that was a wrong one. Okay, I need to keep my distance. Beautiful. Wait, heal it! That was so close! I thought I forgot about my health! If I gotta be honest, I did forget about my health. So that was... I'm a little bit too cocky. See, most of my battles in this game have been jumping. That's what I mean when I say that... Having... um. Having the, 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 the big weapon helps out a lot because it helps me to move a lot faster. Do it again. Which one are you gonna do? No, no that didn't hit me. Excellent. No! Use the back step. Use the back step. Beautiful. Dude, I'm loving the back step right now. It all makes so much sense. Nope. That was so lucky on my end. That was so lucky. Nope. He's about to go down. Oh, that's bad. That's bad. Heal up. Nice heal. Okay, one more heal. And I can be safe. Goodbye, Lady Babak. Or Lord Babak. Or whatever your name is. Beautiful. It's Lord Ladak. Why do I call him Babak? His name was pretty big in front of me. Vals got this bow.
Okay, cuts in. What? What is that shiny on there? So now we have to go to the manor, and then in the manor... Okay, let's see if we can speak with this lady. Let's see if she's got something to say now. Or if she's just gone. Oh, she's gone. Okay. Well, now you know that even if you thought that it was impossible um, to defeat her or to defeat him, I showed you that I'm cursed, but that curse gives me strength. I'm way stronger than I look like. What is this? Room is broken. Okay, I mean, that's pretty much it. So... So with that done, we got another one of these. I do not know what to do with the Heart of Necrux. We also have a Corrupted Heart of Necrux. Um, and uh, yeah, I guess the next time is just going to the manor and progress through the manor? Huh. It's a little bit interesting, but hey, I do not know where to find those little things, like... I, I am missing... <laughs> I am missing the things to give to that witch, and that is strange. But anyways, I guess at this place, this is gonna be a really, really good place to wrap things up. Next episode, well, you guys know how it is. It's probably gonna be either finishing the game, or, well, doing what is it that we're missing. But I hope that right now you guys enjoyed the episode. Thanks a lot for watching, as always, and I'll see y'all in the next one.